Yo, welcome back to Jay Reacts. Hey man, we're on the road to 1K. You know, we do, you know, known artists and underground artists, so we don't, you know, hold back here. Anyway, man, today we got 6 9 official video. Well, it's not official video, it's um the audio for Wait. Um, it's been out for a minute, man, but I'm a big 6 9 fan, man. I like his music, and um, I think he's a good person, man. So, let's get it. And I honestly think this is the, um, this is the NFT. I think it's the NFT picture, too, so... Uh, for all the crypto people out there, I know about you know crypto, crypto, um, like cryptocurrency. Uh, NFTs is basically a picture that you buy, and if you buy the correct picture, bro, it could be worth millions of dollars. You buy them for like 600, 400 bucks, whatever. Some are more expensive than that, but look up NFTs, man. And the next new thing, man, to possibly get you rich. Then he's like, he got him in the feelings again. I got him, I got him jealous again. Got him in the feelings again. <laughs> they all hating on him, bro. Regardless. <laughs> hey, that's true, man. He's like, they they can't do what he can, and it's true, bro. Like. This dude wasn't wasn't like I'm not condoning what he does. I'm just saying like the kind of impact he has on the music on the music world. Like this this dude just came out of jail from snitch and whatever he did. And he goes on IG live and breaks IG, bro. When he first came out, he had two million people watching him live. Never, ever, ever has that ever been done. Ever. Not Eminem, not Jay Z, not Kanye West, nobody. And Six Nine is not even that good of a rapper. You know what I'm saying? It's not even about being a rapper. It's the impact that you have. Like this, I don't even know if he signed. To be honest, and he made, he's making that kind of wave. People people love him, bro. You know what I'm saying? And can't hate on that, bro. Num numbers don't lie. <laughs> I both said that no new hoes I can't do better. <laughs> Oh, I just heard. He said, "Shout out to my lawyer, Lance." Hey, I like that. Respect. <laughs> Yo, this is dope, man. I love Six Nine, bro. I just think he's a dope artist, bro. Like I said, man, I don't condone his his outside life. I guess you can say his personal life, whatever. I don't think he does that anymore. You know what I'm saying? Like now that he's multi multi millionaire, I guess you can say. I, I believe, man. If he didn't bring, no, he'll make no more music from now on. That he'll still live wealthy, bro, because of all the YouTube views he gets. I'm sure he probably owns his masters. And just the way he advertises himself, bro. You know what I'm saying? He's the prime example of a true advertiser, self-advertiser. And that's how he got to where he got to, man. Because he just don't care what people think. You know what I mean? And that's what you got to be in the end of the day, man. You got you got to believe in yourself. You can't care what people think, bro. You just got to do you in the end of the day. Because nobody's going to be there for you if you're not there for you. That's the bottom line. You know, they... 
they're gonna eat and you don't have to eat. They're gonna pay their bills and you're gonna pay your bills. Who cares? You know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, if it, if it works for you and it's gonna make you and take you to that next level, you do you. Nobody had colored hair until Eminem came out. I mean Eminem until Six Nine came out. Nobody. Now I have all these all these up and coming artists with colored hair, pink, purple, whatever. Now it's a trend because he did that. Anyway, man, thank you for watching. To the next one. Peace.